Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and all of you beautiful Egyptian snow chihuahuas out there. My name is Python, and welcome back to another video. Now, today, my friends, as you can see, we have Cities Skylines. I'm not going to lie. I have been wanting to do a City Skyline series for a very, very long time now. I've just never really gotten around to doing it, but now that I'm trying to, you know, experiment with this channel, get some different things out there, I thought this would be quite a nice thing to give a go at long last. I'm excited, guys. I really, really am. So if you guys are as well, please do be sure to drop a like rating. There's going to be loads more games to come as well. Uh, Open TTD is another one I was thinking of potentially making a series out of. Let me know what you guys think. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and start ourselves a new game. This is going to be completely vanilla. No mods whatsoever. And uh, we're just going to play through the core game first of all. Now, I don't want these series to be lasting too long. But at the same time, I want to be able to get a decent amount of stuff done in each of the series. Now, obviously, you know, there's a bunch of DLC going on. You've got disasters, you've got mass transit, all sorts of various bits and bobs. So what I want you guys to do in the comments area below is suggest to me what you guys think the end point for each of these series should be. Whether we have to get to a certain uh, population, for example, or maybe we achieve a certain amount of money. Or maybe even if there's like a bunch of in-game... Oh, what did I just do? Oh, boy. Did I just start the first one? I think I may have just started the first city. Well, okay. Well, that's what we're playing, ladies and gentlemen. That is, uh, that's what we're doing today. All right, brilliant. So, believe it or not, I'm actually no stranger to city builders. I did play SimCity before this. Uh, and even, you know, the regular, you know, the Sim Cities before that. So, uh, yeah. Oh, baby. We are in this place, my friends. Look at this. All right. So, Got ourselves a city, my friends. It is 26.7 degrees Celsius. Oh, my word. That kind of temperature would make me cranky, guys. I'm not going to lie. So, let's go ahead and make a bit of a start with this thing. And like I was saying, I'm no, I'm no stranger to, to City Builders. I've played SimCity before this and all of the other SimCities before that, going way back to SimCity 2000. So, uh, yeah, hopefully, I, I shouldn't wind up embarrassing myself with just how bad I may wind up being. Anyways, so let's get this thing rolling. This is a... Do we have like a... Do we have a one-way kind of deal? Uh, Two-lane road with grass. There should be a one-way road kind of system, but oh well. It's all good. So let's go ahead and try to figure out what we're going to do here. Uh, hmm. In fact... Yeah, all right. Well, fair enough. Let's get ourselves a bit of a row going, shall we? We'll have something like that. And there's the one way. And as far as I know, there should be some way of just converting... As far as I know, upgrade road. There we go. So, uh, boom. There we go. Okay, so that's now a one-way street, which is absolutely fantastic. So, let's continue this on. And I kind of want to continue on the one-way system so we can keep an easy flow of traffic. You know what I'm saying? A nice easy flow of traffic is always a good thing in uh, in Sim... Not Sim City. Oh, my word. <laughs> I almost made that mistake, guys. In City Skyland. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, let's get you going around there. And then off you go. All right, fantastic. Would it be worth me going ahead and doing that as well? I mean, why not, right? I mean, if people want to go around in circles like a dimwit, then uh, feel free to. Feel freaking free to. Right, okay. So let's go around there. And there we go. We're going to serve like a bit of a basic one-way kind of street dealio going on. Now, I think eventually what might be a nice idea is if we were to go ahead. Oh, and we already have these things. Uh, 60, 60 credits per cell. Okay, interesting. Uh, limited speed of 50. Ooh, interesting. Right. So, let's go ahead and get ourselves some power and some various other bits and bobs. Now, I myself, as a citizen of the UK, I, I don't think I would be very, very fond of living next to a power station. So, what I think I may do... Actually, if I just uh, come out of that real quick, I need to try and find the water. There we go. The reason why we want to try and find the water is because we need to be able to pump out any sewage and all that kind of crap from, uh, from the houses that we will wind up eventually having. So, yeah. But well, what this Pythonator is going to do in the meantime is make a road going way over this way. Oh, that might be a bit expensive. Maybe that's a bit too extreme. Uh, let's go to there. Okay. And then we're going to connect ourselves up a power station next to it. Now, here's the question. Do we want to use sort of traditional fossil fuels or do we want to go ahead and use clean fuels? I don't know. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. So, uh, 7 megawatts for 6,000 credits. You got eight megawatts. Wow, that's a, that's a fair amount, actually. But then again, we need quite a lot of power cables to get over there. Uh, but then again, this is nineteen thousand, and it costs five hundred and sixty credits per week to upkeep. 
Like, do we want to go for this as a bit of a temporary solution? I mean, to be honest with you guys, I mean, what's up with windmills? I'm, well, I mean, it says there there's noise pollution. Do we want noise pollution? I don't know, man. Six megawatts. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I think I'd be okay with uh, using a little bit of wind. You know what I'm saying? Right, so let's do that. And should we have two of them? Just so, just as a little bit of a just-in-case kind of deal? Uh, Alright, let's give it a go. Yeah! I'm a green, mean, flying machine! I, I'm not really. Let's just be frank here. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead. Out of city limits. Ah, oh, dang it. Right, so let's go ahead and try to figure out what we're doing here. Out of city limits again. Uh, maybe we go ahead and put the power lines, like, back here or something. Yeah, I think that could work. I think that could work, guys. So, let's do a little bit of this. Space already occupied. All right, brilliant. <laughs> All right, well, let's bring this over here. And hopefully, any minute now, it should showcase where exactly the place is covered. Right? Apparently not. Electricity availability. I mean, it's up there, man. All right. Well, uh, let's go ahead and get ourselves some uh, some little houses going here and there. I mean, this is the entrance to the city. Do we really want residential stuff, you know, in the entrance to the city? What I kind of think might be a good idea, guys, is if we put industrial here and then we make ourselves... I mean, again, uh, noise pollution, uh, I don't know, man. Maybe we could have commercial along here, and then maybe we can go ahead and uh, put residential stuff towards the back over, uh, I don't know, let's say this way, perhaps. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm down with that. I don't know about you guys, but I think I'm down with that. So, yeah. Little bit of that. And then maybe we could just have ourselves a bunch of blocks, kind of like the Americans do, right? Yeah. All right. So uh, let's go and place down some houses, shall we? Let's put one there. Let's put one there. And uh, let's see what happens. Yeah. All righty, guys. Come on. Come on, boys. Come on. Let's go and speed this bad boy up a little bit. Yeah, look at that, baby. We've got some houses coming up. Oh, my word. I'm so proud of right now, guys. I'm legitimately so proud. Are you guys proud of me? Are you guys proud of me? You better be proud of me, man. You better be proud of me. Right. We've got 46,000 credits remaining. What else do we need? We need a water drain pipe, again, to go ahead and filter out all of the freaking sewage. Nobody wants to be having that kind of crap. So, let's go ahead and put it... It's 2,500 credits. Uh, I mean, where is sort of straight from there? I mean, I'm kind of thinking, like, maybe here? And then we could probably do something from there. Uh, make it just go directly over this way. I mean, what's straight? I don't know. I don't know what's straight. Oh, maybe not. Okay, well, there's no real sort of straightness type thing. So, why don't we just go ahead and do a little bit of that? Have it go underneath the roads, right? Why not? Why not? So, let's have that go over this way as well. Just so we're making sure that everything is all sort of, uh, you know, you know, fine and dandy. And, of course, we'll have a little bit going on over this way as well. At least if we actually place it, we'll have a little bit going on over there as well. <laughs> right, so uh, some of these guys are a little bit, you know, worse off in terms of water. Uh, let's go and fix that. Maybe we can get another little bit around here. Connect these up. Yeah. Alrighty. There we go. Look at that. We've got ourselves a nice amount of coverage going on here. Right, and these guys are after some water. Uh, again, this is going to be sort of an industrial area. So why don't we go ahead and uh, place down a water tower. Uh, somewhere around here. Uh, estimated production, 60,000 meters cubed per week. Is that good? I have no idea. Anyways, there you go. And as far as I know, all you got to do is just connect those bad boys up. Right. Is this thing powered as well? Uh, I mean, that's powered. We could probably do with bringing this over this way a little bit. And then potentially over there. And then we could probably get that to go over there as well. Right. So now that should be all powered up and ready to go. So again, if we just go ahead and uh, fast forward this bad boy, we should be able to get this going. Right? Right? Is this thing just slow or something? I'm not entirely sure why that's uh, active, disconnected. It says it's connected. I'm not entirely sure what's going on there. Like, do we need to actually, like, physically connect this? Is that something we need to do? I have no idea. I mean, it says it's connected, but I'm not sure what's going on. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, fantastic. Right, all of these guys should be okay. Yeah. Okay, right. What are we looking for now? We want a little bit of industrial, huh? 
All right, well, let's go ahead and start putting some on the inside here. Yes, yes. Enjoy your workplace. Yeah. All righty, so we've got ourselves a little bit of a zone going on there. Let's fast forward this bad boy. Oh, mate, I'm feeling good, dude. Are you guys feeling good about this little city I've got going on here? Look at that. Oh, my word. I wish things were built as quick as that in real life. For those of you guys unaware, I don't think I've even told this story before, but uh, literally right next door to my house in real life, they're actually making a shop from an abandoned pub. So, yeah, <laughs> that's why I'm saying I wish, you know, I wish construction was as quick as this in real life. You know what I'm saying? Uh, have you noticed you can now zone low density commercial? Yes, I am very much aware of that. Uh, why don't we go and fill these little bits in? Because, I mean, from experience from playing, you know, other city builder games, people don't tend to require commercial that much, right? Hey, look at that. Our loss is actually getting less and less as we go along, which is really, really nice. If we can get that into the positive, I'm going to be very, very happy Python Eddie. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be very happy. All right, let's go ahead and uh, fast forward this bad boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at that. The commercial zones are coming into effect. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> All right, now we're only 450 uh, credits negative uh, per... Is it per week? Or, oh, weekly income. Okay. Fantastic. Right, we need a little bit more residential according to that. Uh, you see, what I'm kind of tempted to do... Oh, I can't do anything here. Reach a population of 1,300. I'm assuming that's population. We've got 133. We're about a tenth of the way there. Uh, wait, sewage? Oh, crap. This thing isn't powered, is it? Oh, whoops. <laughs> Python, you doofus brain! Ah, such an idiot. Why did I not consider that that would be something that's needed? I don't even know, guys. Please don't even ask. Don't even ask. Right. I don't know how I'm going to get this to be sort of nice and straight, but uh, I'll tell you what. Let's go there, and then there, and then... Can I, like, get these two connect to connect up? Huh. Okay. Uh, I might need to go ahead and, uh, like, get rid of this one? Like, this little bit? Can I do that? Oh, I can rotate myself. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, and then I can just go ahead and uh, connect these bad boys up. Boop. Yeah! All right, and uh, is that going to do the job? Yes! All is satisfying, my friends. How's the old wind doing? Electricity availability is still looking good, my friends. I'm very happy with that. Right. And, yep, there goes all of those. All right. So we've got sewage, we've got water, we've got power. Everything's looking good. We've even got some little cars in here. Look at this. Oh, no, these people are mad. Wait, that, that doesn't really... I don't get it. Owner, Walter Walker. <laughs> awesome. Resides at the Garnet Residence. Okay, cool. Uh, negative two. Yeah, look at this. Global happiness. People are happy. I've got a happy... i got a happy, chappy town. This is cool. Okay. Can we go and get ourselves some more stuffs going on? Uh, how's the traffic flow looking? I mean, it's looking pretty good, isn't it? Anyways, the reason why I wanted trees is because I wanted some way of sort of separating the industrial from this area over here. Because, you know, industrial is all going to be polluted. It's all going to be crappy and bleh. You don't want that. You know, you want to have... I mean, you know, trees, they clean the air, don't they? Like, technically speaking, they clean the air. They produce oxygen. So, therefore, I feel like, like, a, like a tree line here would sort of separate it and make this place a little bit more clean. Right? Anyways, uh, let's continue on. Do we want to, like, maybe put a main road in? Is that something that we might want to do? I mean, I could do, but I think that would cost a fair amount. We've got 25,000 credits left, which, I mean, that's... It's a decent amount, but I imagine that could run out very, very quickly. Right, let's go ahead and uh, get back on with this. So, we'll have another one going just here. And how's the roads looking here? Can that go through? No, it can't. Okay, it can go through here, though. Yeah, okay, brilliant. Ah! They don't align, though. I have an itchy mustache, apparently. Anyways, uh, yeah, they don't align. That's that's going to make me a little bit annoyed. Hmm. Okay, let's try that again. Boop. And you come up to here. Yep, and then... Oh, and then you come up to here. All right, nice one. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some more residential. Uh, oh, power. Did I just mess something up? Oh, I messed something up, didn't I? Oh, whoops. Don't mind me, people. Don't mind me. Um, <laughs> I, ju I just cut off your power. It's, it's no emergency. It's no emergency. I, I merely just cut off your power for a little bit. It's all good. It's perfectly normal. It's perfectly natural, okay? Right. 
What do I want to do here? Do I want to just go ahead? I might just make a little bit of a dead end here so we can separate this off. Maybe we can get some residential going on here. Uh, but then again, again, we could probably make a little bit of a dead end there. And then we can have residential going all along there. Right? I mean, why not? Let's go ahead and do it. All right. So let's get you. Come on, buddy. Come on. Still negative 550 credits into the red each week. Which is, you know, not that great. Let's just be frank here. Right. Now we're looking. There's not enough workers, apparently, according to this thing. Huh. Yeah, not enough workers. All right, so we need... We have, we're actually going to need quite a lot more residential. A lot more than I first thought. So why don't we just go and just make all of this into residential? Huh? I mean, why not, right? Let's see, let's see what happens. Come on, then. We should be able to get ourselves a ton more people move in as well. That'd be really, really cool. Uh, so yeah, this is pretty nice. We've got a nice little residential area here. I don't know. This kind of... I don't know. It kind of reminds me of when I when I went to LA and had a bit of a stay in the... Uh, well, <laughs> we... Uh, for Minecon 2016, we were in LA and uh, we had a bunch of hotels. And, and, the, and the blocks were very sort of similar to this, the residential areas anyway. So, I don't know. It's kind of cool. All right. So, these ones are missing water. Uh, okay, fair enough. Let's go and uh, fix that up real quick for you, little buddies. Okay. And you can go over there. All right. Brilliant. Everything's looking good. Negative 186. Guys, we are nearly in the green. We're nearly making money. I'm very happy with that. Hey, man, if we can keep that up, that'd be absolutely brilliant. All right, let's have you. Let's have, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's all good. <laughs> right, now then. Pretty soon, we're probably going to need some fire stations and all that kind of stuff. Because, uh, yeah, you can get fires and various other bits and bobs. Wow, look at this. Up and close seems to be pretty okay. Although, I don't know, once again, I am tempted to try and do some other stuffs, including, you know, upgrading some of the roads, make the traffic flow just a bit better, maybe future-proof it, you know? I don't know, I don't know, maybe we could try that in a bit. Anyways, uh, we're looking once again for some more residential, so why don't we go ahead and uh, build ourselves a new sort of block of roads here. Okay, so that's aligning up there, you can align up there, and then we can maybe even... Just do a massively long road like this. I think that could potentially work. Uh, we're going to need ourselves some more pipes once again, though. So let's just do that. There we go. Uh, yep, yep, yep. That's looking good. Uh, how's your power looking? We're going to need to bring ourselves a line probably out here. Can we... Oh, oh. There we go. Yeah. All right, brilliant. And then we can bring it around here and then probably around the back. I think that'll work. Yeah, okay, fantastic, guys. Dude, we're going to have so many things going on. Like, this is going to be a big-ass street. Look at this. It's going to be huge. Right, now then. Oh, there we go. There is a way of actually segregating the various things. Uh, maybe what we'll do here, though. Space already occupied. Boop. Okay, and then... Boop. Fantastic, right. Uh, we can have, like, a couple more blocks of residential. Let's just fill it in, like that. And then, again, we could probably get some more commercial in. I mean, commercial seems to be a low, uh, low freaking thing right now. Like, there's nothing there at all. Not even industrial. So it is just a case of just trying to uh, grow our residency. Fair enough. Fair enough. I can't complain, dudes. I can't complain. Come on, man. Oh! Hey! There we go! Brilliant. Little Hamlet. Reach a population of 400. Hey, I got 20,000 credits out of that. New features, taxes, loans, uh, new services, garbage, healthcare, and education. We've got a landfill site, elementary school, medical clinic, recycling center, community school, medical clinic, and an elementary school. Nice. Brilliant stuff. Okay. And, oh, right. Okay, so you've got monuments for 65,000 population. Wow, that's a long way away. Uh, reach a population of 800 for unique buildings. And then you've got a bunch of achievements here. Uh, what's, the, what's the latest thing? Megalopolis. Okay, so what do you guys think? Could we... Do you maybe think we should call this particular series done once we've achieved this? Like I say, I'd be very interested to know your uh, comments in the comments area below. And uh, from that, I will probably, in the next episode, put up a poll of all the possible kind of endpoints we can have for each of these series. Uh, so we can keep the flow going, we can keep the different maps going, we can play all the expansions and all that kind of stuff. Because honestly, I'd really like this to be a staple on the channel. I really, really would do. So, yeah. Alright, so there we go. Looking good. Yeah, look at all those fireworks. I'm a very happy bunny right now. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh no, it's gone back below 400. 
Oh, this is terrible. This is a terrible time. Right. Oh, my God. Are we about to go in the green? Negative 49, negative 33, negative 17, negative 3. Oh, we're making money, boys. Let's go. I'm making that dough. <laughs> oh, mate. I'm, a, I'm very happy. I'm very happy right about now. I'm making money right now, dudes. I, <laughs> I couldn't be more happy if you tried. You know what? I'm kind of tempted to keep the one-way system going around the entire industrial district. Therefore, I feel like the, the, the flow of traffic will be a lot easier. You know? So, anyways, let's carry on. According to the, you know, the, the, the wanting of, you know, what's needed, uh, people seem to be wanting a little bit of industrial, at the very least. Uh, maybe we can go ahead and do a little thing here. Just split it off a little bit. So, like that. Why not? And then we'll have a little bit of industrial because people don't seem to be wanting that much industrial, but we can see. Uh, apparently, we need a garbage site. Ah, right. How much does this cost? 160 per week. I mean, that's going to put us back in the red. But do you know what? I mean, if it means that everything's going to be good to go, then why not, right? It's only four grand. It's only four grand. It's going to be a bunch of pollution. Uh, oh, there we go. Boop. That actually fits in perfectly. <laughs> wow. All right, and that's covered that place there. Brilliant. What about a recycling center? 240 credits per week. It's 8,000. And uh, citizens can recycle more different kinds of waste uh, when, the re when the city has a recycling center, making less garbage pile up. The center produces small amounts of raw materials from the waste. I mean, is that worth it? Oh, that's pretty small, actually. We could probably do that. Right? I mean, why not? It'll be like, I might just like chuck it in here or something. Uh, I mean, why, why, why don't we just have it neighboring like that? There we go. Why not? All right, brilliant. Uh, what's going on here? People are sick. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, people are getting sick. Oh, crap. Right, we need ourselves a bit of a, a medical clinic. Medical clinic? Uh, do we just want, like, the lower rent? Wait, are these the Say same? Cheese. It's cheese. We get big bite burgers and fries. All this week, in addition to our regular menu, try our all-you-can-eat signature sides, like our famous bowl full of melted cheese, served steamy and bubbling. It's the bottomless juggler. Or our New Orleans-inspired pork sandwich, the Pig Cheesy. And our signature flagship, the spicy blue cheese top jalapeno cheese blueger. Mmm, so hurry in and get them while they last. After all, why take a little bit? Hey, man, I'd be down with some of that. I could eat that right about now. Right, there you go. Um, oh crap, now we've got no money left. <laughs> Negative 265. Oh, blimey, O'Reilly. Okay, uh, everybody's getting sick! <laughs> oh boy, this is freaking terrible, dudes. Right, let's get ourselves some more residential. We're gonna need to get a bit of a get rich quick scheme going on here, my friends. Boop! And. We need some more residency, guys. So we can make a little bit more of the moolah. Because otherwise we're going to be in some trouble here, guys. Uh, should we have that? Or should we have a bit of commercial? Let's have a bit of commercial there. Why not? Oh, boy. Like, is that going to keep going away as we go? Or are people just legit going to keep dying? Oh, God. Oh, my God. This is terrible, bro. What the hell is going on here? Citizens are sick. There's a lot of Ninos going on. Oh, my word. Am I going to have to increase the funding for this? Oh, boy. Uh, Waterworks just told citizens not to drink tap water or take showers. Oh, bugger. Water pumping station. Uh, pumps water to the city uh, from a body of water. Everybody's sick, man. If a water tower is built on polluted soil... Oh, no! Uh-oh, I know exactly what's going on here. The pollution around here is pretty bad. We should have put it, like, round here or something, dude. Oh, boy. Um, yeah, we're in a... We're in dire straits here, guys. Oh, gosh darn. Okay, right. I mean, all we can do is hope that this goes back in the green and we start making money. Unless we can, like, take out a loan. I'm not actually entirely sure. Let's have a look. Can I take out a loan? Oh. I can have 20k. Uh, weekly cost of 400. Oh, Jesus. 
Oh my word. Is that worth it? How's the how's the electricity looking? Let me just have a look. Uh, electricity is looking is below par. Oh boy. Sewage treatment, water availability. I could probably lower the amount that uh, goes towards water a little bit. Maybe to 80. Probably lower this as well at a bit of a guess. Uh, but I'm very tempted to actually increase this a little bit. Oh boy, this is uh <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Things. Oh no, and now there's no electricity. Oh my word. Dude, this is turning into a disaster. Oh my word. I've got no money though. I've got no money to rectify it, bro. Oh no, are people dying? <laughs> oh Jesus. Oh my god. Right, guys, we're gonna have to do this. We're gonna have to take out a loan. We have to. I'm so sorry, but I have to do this. We need ourselves some more electricity. Uh, let's get you chucked. Uh, let's say uh, here. Oh, Jesus. There we go. And boom. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Right, we need to go and get rid of this damn thing. We can't have it here. No, 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 no. It's polluting the freaking thing. Yes, delete it. Right, we're going to put it in a less polluted area. Uh, let's say, uh, I'm so sorry, but I'm going to have to wind up demolishing one of these things or something. Like, maybe we could put it here. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Boop. Right. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Oh, no. Now we're even more in the red. Oh, my word. Hey! Nice one! And we got ourselves a bunch of money from it! <laughs> oh, thank goodness me! Thank goodness me! Oh, my word. I thought we were in some serious dire straits there, ladies and gentlemen. Jeez, man. Hey, look at that as well. You know, the sickness is all starting to go away. Awesome. I think we did it. I think we did it. We rectified the situation. I am a brilliant freaking city mogul freaking uh managerial type dude thingy person man mayor and yeah everything's good all right ladies and gentlemen so on that successful note i think what we're gonna go ahead and do is end the first episode right there guys thank you very much for watching if you guys have enjoyed this video and you're excited to see more please do be sure to drop a like rating as it will really help out myself the channel and the video very much and it would mean the world to me if you did uh, hit the subscribe button and ding that bell if you don't want to miss out on future content folks and uh, yeah things are looking up guys things are looking up Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.